Sup guys, Icebreaker here. It's Friday, that means it's imitation game, but today we're going to do it a little differently. Um, I've managed to beat all seven stages without deploying any troops or a hero at all. I'll show you how I did it right now. Okay, this is my Smoky Assassin account. It is a 551. That means I have five gunboat energy, five troop damage, and one troop health. However, because we've used no troops or no heroes, the troop damage and the troop health is irrelevant. I've only got my five gunboat energy statues that um, played any role in taking down Hammerman's imitation game this week. So let's jump into it. I'll show you how I did it. So stage one, pretty simple stuff as you can imagine, just throwing the warriors at the back of the uh, HQ there, couple of hits, and that's stage one. Stage two then, I bartered out the cannons and stuff just because I could, it didn't really need to on this one. And then we dropped all the uh, super warriors back in the corner here. And once again, they take out flame fire and stuff that's there, but by the time they've done that, the core goes down. Stage three then. Again, this is a case of just setting it up with the GBE. Bited out the cannons, the boom cannons, and the shot blaster there in the middle. And then that's pretty much it. There's nothing else really that can range it, can make any difference to the attack. The rocket launcher and stuff isn't going to hurt them too bad. So again, throwing the um, super warriors at the back there, out of range of everything, takes down stage three. Stage four, similar story again. There's a trend appearing here, as you can probably imagine, using a GBE to take out all the nearby defenses and stuff that are going to be an issue. Then we've dropped Super Warriors out the back again, which are going to let them farm up some GBE, take out these sniper towers and stuff. And all the time while they're doing that, we'll get a couple on the core. Any extra GBE will get used in RTs on the core itself. That is stage four. Stage five then is pretty easy actually. We're just gonna drop some barrage and artillery on the shock blaster and the boom cannons here. Um, pretty much only things there can arrange. Gonna drop a box of critters on the hot pot to get it popped up, followed by a couple of super warriors and then a shock. As you can see, super warriors are taking out the stone quarry first and then come round for the hot pot which is fine. And then, so they split up, they go to the core. You can see that boom cannon there is still an issue, but we've got a bit of extra GBE now because they farmed up the stuff behind core here. And then they can get down onto core and it's just in a case of letting them do their thing. Got some critters there and stuff for distraction too, just to uh, help keep them healthy. But that is stage five. Stage six was another good one for this. Um, literally all I had to do was bar out the shock launcher and the grappler there um, and then I was able to bar out the boom cannon and then get a super warrior out the back there to farm up some gumbo energy for me and just whilst he's doing that we're using our um, spare GBE to remove the cannons boom cannons and stuff like that and um, you can see there we've got this one on the core while these two are still farming up GBE for us and also taking core health down as well. The real star of this show is this guy here though. Um, GBE that this guy's building up for me, I'm using on shocks on the sniper tower and the boom cannon there. While this one gets, gets the job done on core. As you can see, that's stage six. Really just. Okay, so this is stage seven. Obviously, because we've soloed every stage up to now, we have a spare attack. So I'm using that spare attack to set this one up. And we're gonna use all of our GBE this time on barting out the cannons, the boom cannons, the shock launchers, um, anything and anything really that's gonna be an issue for the super warriors behind core. Um, but yeah, that's, that's the essence of this first attack is just to weaken it as much as you can with what GBE you do have. And that's attack one. And then that damage from the first attack is carried over to this one, except now we've got a full boat of gumbo energy. So we can finish off this boom cannon. 
and then we can uh, finish off a couple more of the little things like the mortar, um, things like that. And then what we're going to do is we're going to drop our super warriors in the middle here. They're going to take out that machine gun and that rocket launcher, farm up some gumbo energy, dropping that warrior there on the flamethrower to take that one down. And then it's just a case of the only things that are left in range are these two machine guns. And they are never going to kill off a bunch of super warriors. So this core goes down as well. So that's all seven stages of this week's imitation game done with no troops and no heroes. Um, unboosted 5GB account. Obviously I've got the tribe boost there for the barrage, which helps. But uh, that's it, guys. That's this week's imitation game. See if you can make the same thing happen yourselves. Why not? Got Super Warriors. Uh, good luck. I will see you next time.